Regents Field camera. Grass is always green at Regents Field. Uh, the sky's not always blue, but we get some blue skies today. 46 degrees the current temperature. It feels like 43, though, with a little bit of a north wind. It's 45 in Gadsden. Still haven't broken out of the 30s there in Coleman. We're at 39 degrees. Haleyville at 38. About 20 degrees roughly colder this morning than yesterday morning. Uh, so just a 24-hour change, and our weather has certainly taken a turn downward as far as the temperatures go. So by 2 o'clock this afternoon, those temperatures will only reach the upper 40s. Our forecast high today is 49 degrees. We'll briefly hit that point with the wind pretty much in place all throughout the day, replacing any kind of air that's heated by the sun with some more cooler. Temperatures already pretty cold by 6 p.m. So even if you're going to run some errands after work, you're still going to need to bring that jacket closer to freezing by about 10 or 11 o'clock. Clean sweep on the WBTM 13 live Doppler radar. The only one of its kind there, 1148 the time as your three minute advantage. Uh, this is a, a site here. I'm looking at some of the visible satellite views right now across areas of the Midwest. And the reason being is because the snowpack that's in place across these particular areas right now, that north wind is going right over that snow, kind of like an old timey air conditioning where the fan would blow over the ice and that's how people would air condition the homes. Well, as that wind blows over that snowpack, it streams right down into the deep south, not going anywhere. There's Tuesday afternoon, we're still dry, Cold air continues to usher into the south, but we're just looking at a bit more cloud cover by Wednesday. Even into Thursday, we do see a more pronounced weather system approaching right around Thursday morning in the Midwest. We'll watch for that timeline, but really it looks like increasing cloud cover and maybe some spotty showers by Friday and Saturday. So forecast high temperatures will be a bit below average for the next couple of days, but as we warm towards the end of the week, that's when the rain chances pop back up. So whenever those temperatures just start getting a little bit warmer than they should be for winter, just remember some changes are likely right behind it. Those changes come on Sunday where highs again similar to today will only top out.